With Monday.com, you have complete control over who can view or edit data today. I'll show the different levels of permissions available as you build out your account. Let's dive in. Here we have an employee directory. This is a main board, meaning it's accessible by anyone in our account. As the board owner, using the board permission settings, I'm able to control what can be edited by our account members. For this directory, I've selected the option which allows team members to only edit items that were assigned to them via a people column. Now, I can assign members directly to a single item to fill out their details. And because of the permission set, they can't fill out any other items. Pretty neat, huh? To take it a step further, using column permissions, I can hide sensitive salary data from all board members and share it only with those that I specify here. Now, I have a main board with restricted elements. If I wanted to control access to the entire board, I could change it to private. Available to pro and enterprise accounts, private boards are only accessible to the team members you invite. Need to restrict information at a higher level? No problem. Just like boards, dashboards can also be private. Once you turn a dashboard private, only subscribers will have access. Owners are able to subscribe team members here. And then by clicking on the gray crown icon, they can switch the team members to owners allowing them to edit away. It's that easy. Moving on, to restrict access for a group of boards and dashboards in one fail swoop, enterprise accounts can switch an entire workspace to closed. Piggybacking off of that, dive deeper to control all actions in a given workspace with these workspace permissions. For our HR workspace, we only want admins of the whole account to be able to create boards, automations, or dashboards. But wait, there's more. Enterprise users have even more power with account permissions. Here we can control pretty much every action in a Monday account, from board creation to the exporting of data. And there you have it. Take back command of your data with permissions. That's it for now. Click here for more tips on getting started with monday.com.